Abby. Hello, I'm Jordy. I'm um, the owner of this pawn shop. Okay, cool. Um, I found this in my basement, and I think it's the first teleport ever made. Oh, pretty cool. How do you know this is real? Well, it has this certificate of authenticity, and it's some research online, and it looks pretty similar to the first one. Alright, so I'll go talk to my friend and see what she thinks about this, but... Alright, thank you. Hey, Rina, so I got this thing called a telephone, whatever that is, and I don't know, it looks pretty real, and it's got this thing called Certificate of Authenticity, whatever that means, and yeah, so you should come down, take a look at this thing. Alright, I'll be down there in like five minutes to go check on this telephone thing. Okay, bye. <laughs> The telephone was invented by Alexander Graham Bell on March 10, 1876. Along with inventing the telephone, Alexander Graham Bell also made it time to teach at a deaf school. This interest in speech and conversation was one of the main reasons why Alexander Graham Bell decided to invent the telephone and improve methods of long-distance conversation. At the time, the telegraph was the most efficient way for people to communicate. After inventing the telephone, people in more rural areas were able to connect with emergency services as well as other family members or co-workers. This new invention of the telephone helped people economically because it helped spur a whole new industry. People were able to need operators and to help work the phone lines. Now for a commercial. Man, traffic is so bad. We need to snap out of this. Oh, dude, watch out, watch out! Uh, oh, no. What happened? There's a dead guy. We killed him. Oh, no. When you're texting and driving with your phone, you're at approximately 55 miles per hour. That's like driving a length of a football field blind. 23% of car crashes are caused by a handheld device. Please, don't text and drive. Mobile phone has impacted a lot of people's lives. The mobile phone makes it easier for people to contact their friends and people they care about. And 80% of young adults prefer texting as their number one way of communication. 65% of phone owners say that a phone helps them get work done while standing in line. 1 in 5 phone owners say having a phone doesn't allow them to forget about work over the weekends or when they get to relax. And now, back to the show. I have a million dollars in my hands, I'm gonna totally rip her off. Okay, so let's see you again. Hey, hi, Abby. So this thing you know is worth about $500,000, but wow. I think I'll give you $15 for it. How does that sound? This sounds pretty good. Thanks, man. I'll see you later. So I think today I got a pretty good deal. Um, since I got all this money, I think I'm going to spend it on some blackjack and hopefully win big.